Hey everybody, Bo here. Check it out. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make these cheap, inexpensive luminaries. The reason I'm making them is it's Christmas Eve, and uh, it is a tradition for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. But what's great about these is they're inexpensive, they're easy to make, and they're great for holidays, they're great for parties. And if you wanted to create a romantic atmosphere, bingo, bango, bungo. So stay tuned. All right. Hey, when I was growing up in the great Commonwealth of Pennsylvania in Pittsburgh, through the church, we used to do these uh, luminaries and our whole neighborhood used to do them as well as the church. And when you would go to midnight mass, it was the most spectacular view because in Pittsburgh, it is hills, rolling hills. So you can be up high and just see neighborhoods and they would all be lined with these paper bag, luminaries these are the simple easiest things to make and basically they're just a paper bag you put sand on the bottom and in the old days you put a, a a candle and you need a fairly thick candle and they'll last through the night here in colorado um i would be afraid to put the candles because of the wind and everything and fire is a four letter word here so anything to do with fire outside we just don't like it but now they make these little tea lights and let me tell you something when these are in here and it's dark it looks like a candle in there you really can't tell the difference and what's great is you can get these on amazon i bought 24 of these for under 10 bucks and i had them to me the next day then i went and got some paper bags from the dollar store 40 for a dollar so this whole thing probably cost me about 10 bucks and uh, these are so much fun because they're just, I've seen people do them in the Southwest. They put them on the roofs of houses and it is just spectacular. These are a welcoming uh, when you line your, your you want to line in front of your house and your walkways and it's supposed to be inviting and hope. And traditionally in the Catholic Church, it's inviting Christ into uh, your home, but it's also almost like an open house type of thing. It's an inviting people into your home, but it is a great decoration and easy to do. So basically all you need is a paper bag, tape the paper bag, open it up, and you want to fold down these sides just like this. I don't know if you can see that. And you want to try and do it without ripping it. And the reason you do this is it makes the bag hold the openness. So it gives it a great steady opening so that it won't blow around in or out. It'll keep it open, kind of like that. And then all you do is put some sand in the bottom, just a little scoop. And one of these. And this, I, I couldn't believe how cheap these things are. Okay, these will last 100 hours. So if you were just to use them one time, you could put these out for four days and they would last. I'm going to put them out tonight. And then tomorrow morning, I will go in and turn them off with the switch. And then tomorrow night, I'll turn them all on. There's 24 of them that I'm doing. This came with 24 in a pack, and they're all tested beforehand so that they work. So this is how they come in a little box. And I say the more, the merrier. So I think you can get 50 of them for 20 bucks. But this was uh, 24, it was under $10. Comes with the battery, ready to go, and boom. There you got it, it's a luminary. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for tuning in. Season's greetings, by the time you see this, probably gonna be over with, but 
Uh, like I say, these are fun for Christmas. They're great for New Year's, birthdays, and if you wanted to do a really romantic setting outside, this would be awesome. Especially if you have 24 of them, because you could put them in all different places. And uh, they're reusable. So afterwards, if they're still working, you could use them and put them around your home, a bedroom, whatever. But uh, pretty cool. Anyway, simple, easy, fast. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you got any comments, any thoughts, please leave them down below. I really appreciate it. Share your experiences with making these. If you got any other ideas, uh, I appreciate them. I mean, you can make these out of coffee cans. You can put lights in them. But uh, for me, I was trying to do it and get it done. And I found this to be the simple, the easiest, and most inexpensive. Plus, you can do a lot of them. 24, that's what I'm doing. So, thanks again. Till next time. See ya!